of trying to get a mandate from the Progressive Conservative Party uh, in order to unite with the Wild Rose and then reach out to other like-minded Albertans. So I hope on March 18 to get that mandate from Progressive Conservatives, then to sit down with the Wild Rose, work out an agreement on a new uh, small C Conservative Party, uh, and then uh, have that ratified by the grassroots membership in a referendum, set up the party and have it elect its new leader. If we don't do this, there is a risk that the NDP could get re-elected. An NDP that will continue to raise our taxes, attack industries, uh, and, and damage our economy. I think the, de the, the damage an NDP government, a second term NDP government could do, would in many ways be irreversible. That's why I think it's essential that Free Enterprise Albertans put aside the labels, park the egos, uh, and put Alberta first uh, by uniting. We did it nationally with the Conservative Party of Canada. Brad Wall's done it in Saskatchewan with the Saskatchewan Party. We can do it here in Alberta. I'm calling all of the former PCMLAs because they get automatic voting status in the leadership election next March. And I'm getting, I mean, there's, there's a few of them here today. I'm getting surprisingly high levels of support amongst uh, a group who, of veterans who I thought be, might be more attached on preserving the brand or legacy, but they're living in the real world and they know we need to unite. So I'm getting a majority, I believe, of the uh, former MLAs who have been there around the table. Uh, and on the Wild Rose side, uh, Mr. Gene's been clear in public. He supports unity, uh, but he needs somebody with whom to unite. Uh, he's sitting at the table re willing to negotiate, but he needs somebody to negotiate with. I'm trying to be that other party. And that's why I'm seeking the leadership of the PC party on a mandate to unite. I take Brian Gene at his word. He said he's for unity. He's waiting for a willing partner. Uh, in the polls, about two-thirds of Wild Rose and PC voters say they are for one united uh, free enterprise party. Um, and so I think the overwhelming member, uh, member, the overwhelming majority of grassroots Wild Roses are there. Mr. Gene is there publicly, stating he's open to unity. And so we're taking them at their word.